Here you have the twins performing one of my usual exercises, ball transfer sit-ups. They're just doing it in a different way. Usually we just count, but I had them do three 30 second rounds. And this exercise, of course, is gonna be for your abs. You perform this exercise when you lift up with the ball, hand it off to your partner, go down, do another sit-up, come back and grab the ball and go back down. That is equal to one rep. It's clear cut and simple. Les Brown said that. He may have taken it from someone else, but I know he's the one that I heard say it. Another thing about it is, great people are too busy to hate. You should be too busy working on yourself to even be able to notice what anybody else is doing in regards to their goals and dreams because you're making yours a reality. Yeah, don't be that quitter. Quitters never win. Don't be a negative statistic. If you're gonna be a statistic, be a statistic on the positive side saying that this percentage stuck with the gym. Definitely facts. Are you gonna fight it out these last reps and get what you set out to get? Or are you going to say it's too hard, give up and quit? That's what's gonna make the difference between you and your opposition. I'll take it one step further. I refuse to be average. I agree 1000%. Working out helps my mental health just as much as it helps my physical health. Life is always going to throw challenges at us. Always. It's the way that we handle those challenges that defines who we are as people. And the thing about it is, that's why I love working out because it gives you a unique ability to be able to handle those challenges that are thrown at you. And the answer is, nobody can stop you but you. Are you? The obstacles weren't sent to break you, they were sent to make you. Make you the strongest, best version of yourself. Well, that workout is done. I want to thank you guys for watching, spending a few minutes with me and the twins, and encourage you to come back and spend a few more minutes with us in the future.